Hey everyone! Today we're going to be creating a tag. These are the ones I did yesterday. I just wanted to show them to all of you real quick. This one I did by using water stains, the same with the ribbon. They're just basic tags. Most of these little tags I did myself with my stamps. I really like this one. These are just simple ones. I just used my stamps for this one. Like here's one where I did a lot of the stamps. I think I did all of them myself. And then we have this one. So the tag size that I'm using is four by seven. I already stained it. I used only the photo. I went over it a quite a times. And then I really focused on the outside, especially the corners. I went over it with the photo and then the black shoot. I think I'm pronouncing it right. Finished it off with the Lost Shadow. I love the that smoky look it gives the tack. Or the finish, I should say. All right. I already cut everything out and laid everything out. So I know exactly what I'm going to do. I have half of a dolly right here. Now, which color you guys going to use is up to you, but I'm going to let you all know because once again, I did some of these tags myself. I'm just going to do the outside since it's going to be covered anyway, most of it. Uh, these are so hard, even with the small glue. It's going to seep through. But I stained most of it myself of everything that I'm going to add. Not saying you have to go out and buy those. Just so that you know, in case you do would like to use the same colors and I think I'm going to put the photo first so I use for the tag that 60 pound cardstock I'm going to put you see the tag needs to go up here so I'm going to put this right here Same here, I used the photo. Just gonna put this, I want this to be covered though. All right, I think that's far enough down. Now this right here is, it's, it's rubber pretty much, it was silver. I make my own sprays, so I sprayed it with espresso. I just use, I don't have a ratio, it just depends on how dark or light I want it. So I use my refill and then add some water. And that's what I used here. And then I went over it with white acrylic paint. I didn't wait until it completely dried because I didn't want it, it I wanted it to be like a dirty white. I think that's how I'm going to do it. But I wanted to actually, but that's too late now, I already have everything glued down. That's okay. I want to, so you can see the stain went through. I did use, I think I said the espresso and photo. Put this here. Now, what am I going to use next? Oh, for instance here, I used the espresso, then the photo, and for the edges, this is a wood cleaner. I mean, not a wood cleaner, a wood finish. It is French rose. It's $2.49. It goes a long way. I got it from Hobby Lobby. I use it for my crafting because it's a nice dark brown. 
I also used this gel stain, which I also got from Hobby Lobby. It was two dollars. Goes a long way too. I used that on the frame also, and my buttons right here, and these little flowers, and then went over it with my white metallic pen. Okay, the next thing I have that I'm going to add is this date. Now, I'm not too fond of this date because it says 1976. So, I'm going to have to change the 9 to an 8 if I can. Oh, the paint's coming off. There we go. I think it says 1978 and the flowers the flowers I'm gonna put I think I'm gonna put it right here I love making tags because they're really fast to make it's pretty much what takes time as always is figuring out how you want everything or what you want to add there we go mm. now my buttons I'm gonna put on this side just gonna start off here These buttons were actually, they were like this off-white, <clears throat> excuse me, like beige. Oh, I wanted them further apart. Oh, this one needs to go down here. And then that one goes in the middle. There we go. Oh, come on, stick. It's removing the ink. All right. <laughs> For the bottom, I have these coupler knobs. Oh, this came out too far. I gotta move this a bit in. This is cheesecloth. I'm going to put them right here. Oh, that's way too much. No. These are so hard to pick up. Of course. And upside down. I could use tweezers. It doesn't bother me that it changed the color because it gives a character. All right. Now, this I did not do the memory. Put it over here. <gasps> Come on, my friend, stick. All right, I'm going to have to just push them down for a minute. All right, now this is also cheesecloth, which is stained with the photo and the, oh, espresso I'm just gonna put it through if it goes through it's kind of thick oh I love making tags I know I just said it but I really do they're just so simple oh can I get it through here now All right. There we go. 
there's the tag. I think it took me less than five minutes, <laughs> but I did have everything prepared. All right, let me know how what you think of the tags or any of my other tags. Do you enjoy creating tags? I know some people actually just do tags and that's it. Thanks for stopping by and making the tag with me. Until next time, everyone, take care of yourself. Bye-bye.